Hey everybody. So I made a lovely garden tour video with uh, Annabelle losing her mind because she's broody. But I shot the whole thing sideways. So instead of that wholesome content, you can listen to me bitch about trannies for a couple minutes instead. How's that? So I keep getting texts from Haley Stevens' campaign um, to help out with funds and whatnot. And the thing is, my wife and I volunteered for her campaign on her first run. Um, and so that's why we're on the list. And I keep asking whoever's sending me these texts, you know, what is a woman? Should males be incarcerated with females? The usual. And I keep getting no reply. So I'm thinking no one's reading these texts. But today, when I asked what is a woman, somebody said, oh, we'll remove you from these texts. Do you need help with that? Show you what. Can you want to be on the video? No. Okay. I'm not showing her. I'm pausing you. So. No. What did he say about? This time, this time, somebody sent back and said, "Oh, we'll remove you from the list immediately." And I'm like, oh, "How dare you? Video. I'm making a video. Yeah. <laughs> How dare you ignore us? We're old lesbians. We've been here forever. Like, and uh, so I was so pissed. I called the office, and this little snot-nosed boy answered the phone and then I got put on I started going off about what had happened and clearly you know I wasn't um you know super measured or whatever but I was very like what is a woman do you believe that males should be incarcerated with females the usual right so they uh some other dude gets on the phone some tranny lover and is like telling me off and I'm like what about young lesbians being sterilized and mutilated what about this what about that you know what about women's sports being ruined and uh, these are strawberries going in this bed we're gonna have three of them oh this is personal he was saying yeah yeah oh he's like oh it's personal to me because i have family and friends and blah 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 and i'm like i'm like how is it not personal to me i'm a lesbian i'm watching my community get decimated right i'm watching my community get decimated and this right forced teaming and i 100 percent disagree with kathy brennan on this this is forced fucking teaming and I've had it, had it, I've had it with it. So, uh, yeah, so I wasn't being nice, but, you know, I wasn't, I wasn't swearing at him. I didn't. And, uh, anyway, he couldn't handle it and hung up on me. So, but the la one of the last things I said before he hung up on me, I, I, this is why you're going to lose the midterms. You guys, come on. You expect us to erase ourselves and not have women's shelters to ourselves and just allow whatever. Oh, he actually said, "Do you, are you saying that you think someone would identify as something that they aren't just to get into those spaces? And I'm thinking, brah, dudes will literally, I have read about dudes who will literally climb into the tanks of porta potties to watch women defecate from below. What won't men do? What does Valerie say? They'll swim through a river of sh shit, right, baby? Yep. That's right. And vomit and whatever else, she says. For if there's a friendly pussy at the other end. Yep. Right? Yeah. That's what they'll do. So, oh, I'm hot. I'm hot. So I'm working it out in the strawberry patch. Get out of the picture, baby. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to swing around. I'm going to show. I'm going to switch this. <laughs> so, uh... So this is what you missed on the fabulous garden tour. We uh, decided to basically um, mulch the entire backyard because we're sick of dealing with it. This is gonna be under, um, I don't know, I think we're gonna build a little stage out of pallets or something, put it up out of the grass. She doesn't like being in the grass. She's allergic. So we got these beds, we got another one coming in over there. We got these strawberries set up today. We're under a tent, it's really hot out today. So, But this is all going away and we got a couple little Rivers of grass, one here, and I'm trying to pan slow. Sorry, I'm trying to keep my temper now. And one that starts here and goes all the way around the back of this tree. That will be all the grass that's left here, and that's going to save me. That's going to save me literally hours of work every week, and in weeding time and keeping the grass out of everything. That's like the worst weed. It also makes it a lot cooler, and it's more opportunities for us to just we've been popping pots wherever we can put them because we feel like this fall <clears throat> might be really important to uh 
have vegetables for whatever reason. So um, I hope everybody is having a more calming day after Memorial Day, but you know, call up and bitch, let them know. Don't be quiet, don't be silent. They can ignore us, but it doesn't make them right. Bye.